What is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking Joss 84 here bringing us more information about Black Ops 3. Today, we're going to be talking about the lethal and tactical equipment of Black Ops 3. So, let's start off first with the lethal equipment. From left to right, we got ourselves the frag, Semtex, Thermite, C4, Trip Mining, and the Combat Axe. Now, the new equipment that we got here is called the Thermite. And what does it do? When you throw that stuff to the ground, you should be able to regenerate your health as fast as possible. So that's pretty much what it is. It's just a healing station that you just throw to the ground, which is kind of a waste of time if you think about it, because the only time that you really need the thermite will be doing hardcore mode and search and destroy if you get shot. So um, yeah, because in the regular game modes, you can already health regenerate by yourself. If you're just standing by or you just keep running, you health to regenerate as fast as possible. So yeah, it's really kind of a useless equipment if you're like running in domination and regular TDM. Another piece of equipment I would like to talk about will be the trip mine. The trip mine is actually a bouncy Betty. As far as I know, a lot of people have been comparing it to the bouncing Betty. So that's good. At least I know how to that we can now protect doorways and stuff. Uh, moving on to the next section, we got the tactical equipment. We're going to be starting from left to right. Concussion, flashbang, EMP, smoke screens, trophy system, and the shock charge. And of course, the longest return of all time, the Shock Charge. It's finally it's back, you know. It's been like since Black Ops 2 that we finally get to see it again. And uh, it's a good piece of equipment because it will let us know where people are coming from. It should like shock your opponent like for a good two seconds and then he will be able to run again. And uh, you know, the moment when he slows down, you get a chance to kill him. So the Shock Charge is actually a great piece of equipment. Uh, the next equipment we got ourselves returning is also the Flash Bang. We did not have the Flash Bang in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, which pretty much pissed me off because every time I would throw the stun grenade, it didn't do shit. You know, people can actually still see me and kill me. It just slows them down like for a good old one and a half seconds. So I'm glad the Flash Bang is back. So now I can actually blind people. So um, that is it, guys. Those are the lethal and technical equipment. If you guys got any questions, please leave it in the comment section. So that is it. Subscribe for more if you guys want to see more Black After information.